What's up guys, welcome to the video. As we said yesterday, we are gonna be using the dragon claws today with the dragon knives. So I'm fairly sure this is gonna be quite overpowered. The combos we're gonna be doing today aren't gonna to be too complicated. They are just gonna be very efficient. So I'm gonna be doing like a one tick. What's happening here? I yeah, just saw some real world trading going on dude. So because of this we're going to be PKing in Bounty Hunter for the most of it just because of how much money we could actually PK and how overpowered I feel this combo will actually be. But yeah later on we might get quite bored of this so we'll switch it up and bring some more weapons and um, maybe the Obi Mole. Um, I guess you guys will see as the video progresses I guess. Dude this guy has... What's this person doing? This guy's a tier 6... Oh what? Skip me. Not cool man. We literally just PK'd like 50k. That's <laughs> so weird. Good luck, bro. Oh, he's from Australia as well. Nice. Hey, duh, that's... No, we're just... We're... Oh, my God. I thought, you know, he's from Australia. I'm from Australia. I thought there was going to be a little bit of respect, but no, he went for the special attack in the first two seconds. <laughs> no, no, that was completely my fault. I was just... I was, like, too busy looking at something else, dude, and I just wasn't expecting it. All right, we're just going to uh, pretend that fight never happened, and, um, and yeah. quick fight good fight man nice and quick fight this is so cool dude i can just sit here and click and it all goes into my looting bag oh so nice okay it's pretty much all of it let's just give it a quick price check at the moment okay so 406k plus the emblem plus a couple of sharks about 500k uh, we have a target with a tier 4 nice okay so i'm fairly sure my combo with the rune knives will actually work out better than dragon knives let's have a look though Yeah, that's a lot better. Because dragon knives, you can't really do the whole running around thing because they nerf the um, movement on them. So with the 50% special attack weapons, I would say that the rune knives are actually better. So what we might do for a bit is head over to PvP and do a little bit more dragon knife PKing with the claws and see if we can get some cool combos. And then after that, we'll do some fancier stuff. That's it, GG bro. I saw the XP drop and I was like, nah, no way he's surviving that. Good fight, man. Okay, and the loot is a total of... Um, I'm pretty sure all these were in there. 260k, which is pretty good. Like, it's awesome that Voiders at this combat level have really low HP. It means that, like, I can pretty much kill everyone with just the Dragon Claws, like, the first special attack. Might get him here. Hey, we got him. Good fight, man. Dude, the DPS on the knives just packed it on. Far out. Like, the DPS on the dragon knives combined with the DPS on the dragon claws is just crazy. Like, it's pretty much impossible to eat through when, um, if I get lucky with my damage. About 300k. Give or take. Pretty decent. This poor pure isn't going to be able to eat out of this DPS, dude. Did we get him? Oh, no. The pit saved him. Dude, that's so unlucky. Like that 25 literally just stacked just after the pid. Like scratch him. Oh, ho, ho, ho. very lucky, man. Good fight, dude. This guy's movement is actual pointless. Like he's not, he's still staying within two distance. So there's no real point. And hello. Do we get him? Dude, I don't know what just happened. I'm actually so confused. Whatever, good fight, man. And the loot. It's pretty good. 300k. Hang on. 350k. Not too bad. Would you look at that? Somebody our combat level, dude. Perfect. Good luck, man. Axe. Oh my. No! Dude, if we had the axe, I might have actually killed him. Look at these knives go, dude. Revenged. Man, if we got lucky with those hits, might have actually killed him. Oh, good fight, man. That was a crazy stack. Good fight. See, I want a looting bag right now so I can sit here and click, 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 click and not worry about my inventory space, dude. This guy's my combat level and he's unsculling, so great opportunity for me. Good luck, man. And... Whoa, why did that happen so slowly? Oh, we got him, but we... Oh, damn it, we misclicked. Jagoats, can you please change this to angry fish? I mean, look at this. That isn't an angler fish, that's an angry fish. The loot is a whopping... Yeah, let's, let's, let's not even talk about that. See if we can smite this guy's ballista. Good luck. Oh, 
love rip. Good hits, but I think the time was just a bit off. <laughs> and he ate to full HP. Dude, he ate over full HP. The hell? Unfortunately, the combo doesn't work very well because after the Dragon Claw... Come on, Drink Man. After the Dragon Claw special attack, when I do the throwing axe, it, the throwing axe just takes forever to throw. Like, the only way this combo would work is if I use the G-Mole after the D-Claws instead of the actual throwing axe. And the only way I can do that is if I don't use the throwing knife spec, which sort of just defeats the whole purpose of using the Dragon Knives in the first place. So basically, Dragon Knives plus D-Claws isn't as effective as you'd think. Oh, this isn't very fair, but whatever. Look. Oh, it's a cool switch, but the hits, dude, unlucky. Oh, we're out, good fight, man. I need to bring a KO weapon, but dude, at least we know that that switch is actually possible. I just have to do it, like, really, really quickly. <laughs> GG. For such a simple combo, that is actually so effective, like, especially against pures. Like, I feel like if this account was lower combat, or if I was on a pure, that would probably be one of the most effective combos. And you can even pull off a G Maul after that, dude. Like, that's crazy. <laughs> GG, man. Oh, that combo is just sweet. Good fight. Dude, look at my fashion scape as well. Look how beautiful I look. 10 out of 10, man. <laughs> that stack was just huge, dude. Like, he had no chance of surviving that. That was crazy. Good fight. Like, he didn't lose anything because he was unscold, but it's still so much fun. Oh, good fight, dude. That's like literally the pure. It's like an anti pure combo, dude. Like, that's insane. And like the amount of damage that you can do as well, it'd be so easy to smite people. I think I'm just going to continue doing that against like scald pures. And at some point, I mean, you just have to smite someone, dude. It's just way too much damage. See, this is the loot that we're getting from pures. So um, hopefully, we do get some smites at some point. <laughs> Might knife him to death. Yeah. <laughs> oh, good fight. I don't know why he didn't tab for. Oh, right, because of the new update, he probably did try to tab. Because, yeah, when you spec now, you have to wait a couple of seconds before you can um, before you can actually tab. So, so this guy wants to fight. Blood dude. Thanks, man. Appreciate it. This guy's a fire cap, so he probably has an HSG mall. Um, yeah, man. But um, he might also have the claws because of his combat level. So, um, yeah, we'll see. Cool combo, missed out one of the specs though. And, oh no way, two HP, bad luck. Or oh, we might be trying to tab, can we get him? Hey, we got him, good fight man. Man, that update is actually so cool. Thanks man, appreciate it. Like I think I've died once to it, but it's worth it because I've killed like four or five people now with it, so it worked out pretty well. The loot is about 255k, give or take, so quite nice. Okay, this guy wants to fight. Good luck, man. Let's see if we can get him nice and quickly. No. Dude, the combo is sick, but bad hits. Damn, good fight, man. Well, the switches were there. It was just bad hits. Unlucky. And... Hey, got him. Super combo. Good fight, man. Dude, I can't wait to do that on like a level 85, just pure void account. That'd be so good. Or an account this combat level that has rigor. Like, dude, that's going to be such an overpowered combo. It's going to be crazy. Like, it's essentially the same thing as throwing two knives into the ballista spec, but you're hiding it with a G-Mole into the middle of it. And that G-Mole can be an extra, like, 30 damage, which is crazy. Like, that just, just secures the kill almost. Imagine that combo there, but instead of having this gear here, I have the heavy ballista, I have elite void, I have the new Ava, and on top of that, I even have rigor. Like, that... Oh, dude, this is going to be incredible. All right, this will be our last fight, guys. And then, um... Yeah, then we'll call it a day. X or the zero. Oh, scary. Last chance. Yeah, no. Bad luck. Good fight, man. As for today, we had quite a lot of fun. Um, it turns out the fruit knives are actually better than the dragon knives for dragon claw special attacking. Like, especially if you go one, two, three dragon claw spec. 
um, just because you can do the whole running around thing. So um, yeah, I'm a little bit disappointed with that. But that's not to say these are useless. Like they are still very, very good for doing that one tick trick, but I just found that it wasn't too effective. But um, no, no, that was just my experience at least. But yeah, that's pretty much it guys. See you tomorrow.